the latest version of the Meta App V68 makes any OpenXR game open in the desktop and not display properly in the headset. Now while we wait the 7 billion years for Meta to fix their insane screw-ups, uh, I'm making this guide here because I'm a pretty large VR creator and no one's really made a simple guide. So I'll leave the original post linked in the description down below. So first of all, what you're going to want to do is make sure that your Oculus Meta Horizon Quest Go Rift app is closed. OVR Server EXE, you want to click End Process Tree. But once you've got every single one, you can be absolutely certain there's no Oculus bullshit running, then you can continue with the next steps. Before you do anything though, it's important you copy this app.acer file out. It's about 400 megabytes, so you know you know it's something not to be missed. Uh, but this is the main reason they suggest you back up your Oculus version. You want to download these three links here. Now, a lot of people viewing this tutorial may be children, so while I believe these links are safe, just know that anything you download from the internet, specifically Google Drive, Mega, anything Softonic, can be malicious, have malicious code, and can do things that you don't want it to do to your computer. Have an antivirus or whatever. I assume these links are safe, as that's what the official Pavlov Discord is telling us to use, um, but just bear that in mind. If you live in Australia, it's probably best to let this do it itself overnight. I want you to leave a comment and say, wow, you've got really fast internet, Jackie. Just make me feel a bit better about myself. So once you have these three little zippity zip files, I'll make sure to put it somewhere. I'm just going to call it vworking because that's the kind of file naming thing I use. You can call it whatever you want. It'll be all good to have a untampered version of all three of these. That way, when Oculus push out v69 and it won't be so nice because they won't fix any issues, you can do this again. Which means more watch time for me. Not sure why the Redditor did see Windows Program Files Oculus, but you want to head to see Program Files Oculus. Then it will take you here. Overwrite all of these files. And then you just want to do that again for the Diagnostics one and also the Runtime one. And just replace the App Acer file with the one that you backed up. Now you're all good to open the Oculus app. I've heard reports that you'll need to repair your device. Don't ever click this button. Don't ever fucking click this button. I, I'm, there's nothing in the Reddit post about this, but I'm assuming that'll re-download V68. In here, it'll still display V68. OVR server, 64 EXE. Properties, details, and now you can see it's running version 62. So yeah, you can see that now VR works um, like it has for the past six years until Meta released this update. So yeah, if this helped you, you owe me a like and subscribe.